Hello, welcome to my channel Psychometric Solutions. In this video, I'm going to show how to do the little test for data missing completely at random. But before this, let me explain what is the little test for the missing data completely at random. It would be particularly useful for the beginners. So, the data which is com missing completely at random is one of the basic uh, assumptions of the data, uh, missing data analysis. Uh, while uh, values in a data set are missing completely at random, if the event that led to the any particular data item being missing are independent both of observable variables and of unobservable parameters of interest and occur entirely at random. Uh, the little uh, test for the data which is uh, missing completely at random uh, is particularly useful for testing the assumption of missing completely at random for multivariate partially observed quantitative data. Actually, this test was introduced by Roderick J.A., Professor Roderick J.A. Little uh, in 1988, and his uh, work was published in the Journal of American Statistical Association. So, uh, the researchers uh, performed the little test for the data, which is complete, missing completely at random. And they perform this test before doing any other uh, uh, thing with their missing data, like data imputation or anything they want to do, either want to delete the uh, cases which have the missing data or any other option. Uh, if any data which has achieved uh, uh, missing completely at random level, it means that the P level is uh, larger than 0.05 and is uh, not less than 0 0.05. Uh, the appropriateness of the data for being uh, missing completely at random uh, is that it value, the probability value, p value is greater than 0 0.05 level. And uh, this shows that the data is uh, appropriate for uh, any remedial action. So, how to perform the little test uh, in SPSS? So, you go to the analyze and then uh, click on the missing value analysis and here uh, you can see we have uh, the hypothetical uh, data of uh, nine variables and it has a uh, missing data. So, in order to know whether the data is uh, missing completely at random, we perform the little test. And for this purpose, I entered the uh, all variables into the quantitative variables since they are not categorical variables. And then I click on the EM. And on the EM, I click here. Uh, it's by default normal, so I keep it normal. Since I am not doing the data imputation, so I will not click on the uh, save complete data. And then I click on the OK. So here you can see the percentage of the missing data per uh, variable. So the variable 1 has 10 missing cases, which is uh, totally 18%. Uh, here we have the mm, little MCAR test value uh, and it is uh, 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 not significant or it's uh, more than 0 0.05 level uh, and this is a good thing uh, in this we, we can know that the data is actually uh, missing completely at random and this is a good thing because now we can make a decision that why the uh, we do the data imputation or we do the uh, deletion of these cases but as per rule we cannot do uh, data imputation because uh, 
majority of the uh, variables have data exceeding and the missing data which is exceeding the 10 percent uh, only two cases the v4 and the v8 have the uh, missing data which is uh, below the 10 percent so we can go for the data imputation in these two variables so this is how you can perform the little test uh, and you can interpret it in the SPSS.